Now, in his State of the Union address this week, President Biden warned Russia's billionaires that we're coming to seize your yachts, your luxury apartments and your private jets. And clearly worried, the super-rich Russians have now started running. According to reports today, at least four super yachts owned by um, these Russian billionaires were spotted moving towards Montenegro and the Maldives. The other assets which could be seized potentially are their properties in the UK. The UK government is said to be drawing up plans which will hit nine oligarchs, including Russia's youngest a billionaire, who's also Putin's former son-in-law. The Guardian has reported uh, that some of the oligarchs have who are under sanctions have been linked to nearly 200 million pounds of property in and around London. One of them, Peter Avon, who is the main shareholder in Russia's largest private bank, he has an 8 million pound house in London with a massive art collection, while another one, Mikhail Friedman, a financer, purchased a property in London for 65 million pounds back in 2016. And in more bad news for the rich guys, even tax havens are freezing the assets of Russia's billionaires. Monaco has already done it, and uh, that's why uh, some of them are trying to move their money to other places. Uh, the sanctions also include travel bans to the Europe and to the US. And there are reports now uh, that President Biden will be announcing more sanctions against them later today. Under pressure, some of these oligarchs have now started speaking out against the war in Ukraine.